What do you like the most about Farney Keaty? The people. The people are so friendly. Um, they are so giving. And when we were moving in, one of the neighbors brought us our meal. Um, they, uh, we had a surprise bouquet one day of roses. Uh, didn't know who, just recently found out who the giver was. And as you drive through the, the neighborhood, uh, everyone just waves. And uh, it's, the lunch bunch is great. We, we experienced that for the first time this week. And uh, we just had a, a ball meeting lots and lots of new friends. What do you like the most about Farney Kitty? I like everything about Farney Kitty. I like the people here. They're, there's such a variety of people from all kinds of backgrounds, and that makes life a lot more interesting. I also like the community feeling here, and I like the, the safety, if you will, of being in a place like this. Um, I think, if anything, it puts my children at ease more, because now they don't have to worry about, what am I going to do with mother someday? Because the beauty of this place is that if I get to the point where I need extended care, I have a place to go, and it just falls right into place. What do you like the most about Farney Keaty? Well, I guess when we first moved here, the main thing was that we traveled, and I could just lock up the house and leave and come back whenever we wanted to and everything was okay because Barney Keeney took care of everything. And the friendship with all the different people is uh, a nice asset to your life. Have you made any new friendships at Barney Keeney over the years? Yes, quite a few. Um, I've been involved with the uh, Independent Residents Association, and through that I've gotten close to, uh, to be close friends with some people. And uh, with neighbors, uh, I live in an apartment, and uh, uh, there are others on either side of me, so I've gotten to know them quite well, too. And I've met a couple of unique uh, older gentlemen, and I am, who uh, participated in the Second World War. And being a history buff, I've really enjoyed uh, talking with them. Uh, one of them flew in B-17 bombers for 35 missions, and I, we have a lot to talk about. Another gentleman worked on the Western Maryland Railroad for many years with steam engines, and my great-grandfather was an engineer on the Western Maryland, so it, uh, I've met some very, uh, very unique people here. Tell me how your life has changed since you moved to Farney Keaty. Well, it's changed considerably in some ways. In other ways, I don't feel like it's changed much at all. Um, I really had never thought about retiring, and I retired at 81 finally. And the reason I retired at 81 was because one of my sons said to me one day, Mom, what are you going to do when you retire? And I said, well, I'm not going to retire. They'll carry me out feet first. And he said, okay, but what are you going to do when you retire? So then I thought I'd better start thinking about it. And having grown up in Hagerstown, at that time I was living in upstate New York, uh, I knew the area and uh, have relatives here, so I kind of wanted to come back to this area. And when I looked into Farney Keaty, it just seemed to be a perfect fit. And the thing that's good about it is that my children, who live away from here, do not have to worry about what I'm going to do with mother someday. Because if I need extra care or extended care, I have a place to go because that's the purpose of this community. You start out on level wherever you are and then you can always progress or whatever happens. If you need to have more care, you get it. It's, it's available.